let's take a look at the new size of finesse craw we've just added. This is a two and a half inch finesse craw. So it's a beefier version of our current finesse craw. So the current one here is 1.75 inches. So you can see a little bit of a difference there. Uh, the 2.5 incher just has a lot more beef, a lot more bulk to it. Uh, this larger size, we really had uh, bass in mind for this guy, large mouth, small mouth, uh, and also the BFS guys too. BFS guys are really going to like this, this bigger size. If you throw your little micro craw in there too, you can see all three different ones there. The micro craw is a great panfish bait. And then you kind of go up to the next size, that finesse craw there. Um, that's really uh, also great for panfish, but also bass too. Um, ultra finesse presentations, little micro spin jigs. Um, trout also really like this one and three quarter inch size as well. Once you jump into this larger size, you're more into bass territory here. Trout will also eat that. Really big panfish could, could get a hold of it, but most guys that are going to like this um, new larger size are going to be um, bass guys and uh, BFS guys. Um, smallmouth will absolutely just destroy this little guy. So I'll show you a few different ways to, to fish it. If I was just to pick one of the most simple and basic ways to fish it, it would just be on a simple jig head. Uh, this one here is on a size 2 hook with a 1 8 ounce uh, ball on it. And this is probably one of the most effective and easiest ways uh, to fish this little guy. Um, keep it in contact with the bottom. Just pop it up and down. Um, get that craw to just hop, hop. Um, yeah, that's probably the easiest way to fish it. But there's a few other new ways that are uh, kind of coming out that are pretty effective. This is the new little micro Jika way of fishing these. It has a little Jika weight that suspends uh, off of this hook. And uh, this will basically allow your bait to hover just above the bottom. So it won't get buried down in the weeds where the fish lose it. Um, the idea is this one can just hover uh, above the bottom. And uh, I'm just using this little Ryugi hook in a size 3. Size 2 would also work just fine for this little guy. And you can use a 1 16th ounce or a 1 8th ounce uh, little Jika weight. And yeah, that's a great little way to fish it. Not many guys know about this uh, way to fish yet, but it's pretty pretty cool, especially if you have just a bit of scum or a bit of weeds on the bottom of your lake. Um, this will just help kind of keep it up off of that so the fish can see it. Another new way to fish this is the Cheb rig. Um, this is a very popular uh, new technique that I kind of just found out about. I'm fishing that same little uh, EWG hook from Ryugi uh, and I just added a uh, Cheb weight under the front of this and this Cheb weight just allows this bait to pivot and move, adding a lot more action uh, to your bait. And this is really just meant to be dragging on the bottom, just like a crayfish would be just crawling uh, on the bottom. And this little weedless hook will help it from uh, getting hung up. But great little way to fish it. BFS guys, this is pretty popular with them because these little uh, Cheb weights are pretty heavy. So you can uh, get a nice, compact, small little bait with um, quite a bit of a weight to it. It keeps that bait uh, in contact with with the bottom. So those are just a few different ways you could fish it, but of course you can drop shot it. You can kind of just do it all, all the standard ways that you can fish any of our baits. Uh, and you can find them on our website. We're, we're kind of just starting to pour uh, these. So this is the Craw Diddy color that's available right now. I think we have our electric watermelon uh, on the website right now that's available. So uh, you'll just kind of see more and more in this larger size uh, trickling into stock on the website. And uh, of course we have lots of our one and three quarter inch finesse crawls on there right now too. So uh, go pick yourself up some. You can find them at moondogbaitco.com.